Here's a short lesson on social customer service. Better stated, how to handle negative comments on social media. There's three things that I'm certain about. You're gonna die, you're gonna pay taxes, and people will disagree with you online. I'm as mad as hell, and I'm not gonna take this anymore! The other day when somebody decided to leave three negative comments on my social media post, I had to take action, I had to respond. The content of his message is irrelevant, but the fact is he wanted to publicly share his displeasure about me on my social pages, and he did. Now, instead of defending myself and getting into a non-winnable argument and giving that person the pleasure of a backhanded public response from me, I decided to take, and get this, personal action. Well, I'm not going to leave you alone. I created a friendly, positive, help-offering response, but I decided not to post it until after I called him. I found out where he worked, called his office, got his cell phone number, and called him personally. I am as sorry as you are, Dimitri. Don't say that you're more sorry than I am, because I'm capable of being just as sorry as you are. So we're both sorry, all right? You know, sometimes angry people just want to be heard. and. I gave him the opportunity. He had my ear. Turns out, the guy was the CEO of a seven-figure business. And after a few minutes on the phone, we figured out what went wrong and resolved the issue. Now, I threw in some free stuff, and it's on its way to his house right now. What's the lesson? Dude, don't give negative comments response the same way you received them. Get personal right away respond to them privately, and try to contact them directly. The result of the phone call? Sure, I gave him a few freebies. He's a happy customer, willing to do business with us or me again. And oh, by the way, he deleted his posts before we could even respond to them. Here is the secret. Serve personally, and you will achieve socially.